joining our daily outlook and today we'll cover the changes in Bitcoin USD pair. Greg will be sharing insights from our trading desk. The Bitcoin dollar pair plummeted 1.4% in the last session. The stochastic RSI indicates an overbought market. The last session saw NIO shares gain 1.6%. The MACD is giving a positive signal. The Aussie got a slight bump of 0.1% against the dollar in the last session. The stochastic RSI indicates an overbought market. The gold dollar pair made a minor downwards correction in the last session, dropping 0.1%. The stochastic indicator is giving a positive signal. Thank you for sharing with us. Now let's hear from our news department. Gold prices edged lower as Treasury yields held firm while investors digested comments from Federal Reserve Chair Jerome Powell and looked forward to U.S. jobs data due later this week for more signals on U.S. interest rate cuts. The dollar slipped in choppy trading after Federal Chair Jerome Powell struck a slightly dovish tone in his comments, suggesting that the U.S. central bank is more than likely to start its easing cycle later this year. Over half of the top American hedge funds have disclosed exposure to newly launched spot Bitcoin ETFs, as BTC slash USD has significantly outformed major stocks and indexes. 13 out of the top 25 United States hedge funds had owned Bitcoin ETFs by the end of Q1 2024. Thank you for this. Coming up today's major economic event. Australia's retail sales will be released at 1.30 GMT. Japan's Jibun Bank Services PMI at 0.30 GMT. Spain's unemployment change at 7 GMT. The US ISM Services PMI will be released at 14 GMT. Japan's foreign bond investment at 2350 GMT. The US ADP employment change at 1215 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed today's market outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to join our next review for the latest news and events from the financial markets.